when it comes to actually really um, ensuring that you you know you're hitting your prospects um, daily or more than once or 15 times and you're not forgetting where you are at um, a great tool that we I like to use is outreach I know there are other tools on the market that are very similar such as sales loft but yeah these tools are great for cadences these tools are great to for you to actually track where you're at with prospects and create your own sequences etc which again I think is key um, the other thing that I use and this is something that I mentioned previously I know there were questions around video videos I've never never heard of that um, that technology and questions around loop um, Loomly um, is Vidyard. So I use Vidyard, I use Outreach. I also use Hunter for email addresses. Um, and I know there are a couple of uh, tools out there for, uh, for great numbers and emails as well, such as uh, Cognizum. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm pretty old school. And when it comes to voice notes, for people who uh, didn't hear before voice notes, it's if you're connected to someone on LinkedIn, send them a voice note instead of a message. and they will 100% listen to it as opposed to opening your message. Definitely, definitely. Yeah, um, here at Capdesk, we use quite a lot of uh, tools just to sort of streamline the efficiency, get as much data as we can and sort of understand our prospects as much as possible. Uh, so one of the things that we use for our sort of like data and CRM is HubSpot. HubSpot's like really beneficial because it gives a really easy way to uh, track our prospects, see where they're at in the life cycle stage, see what data points, for example, pages they've visited, in, uh, clicks they've uh, clicked on, all of that sort of stuff. So HubSpot's really good for that. Uh, we also use SalesLoft for quite a few sequences and cadence as our sales enablement tool. And just like HubSpot, you can get really good data points about them. So you can see how many times they've opened up specific emails, how many times they've clicked on a certain link. So it's really good. And utilizing uh, LinkedIn sales nav, as just I said, with uh, trying to build out lists, trying to uh, find the ideal personas, really helpful. And of course, uh, when reaching out to actual prospects, how we get the numbers, emails addressed, and sort of uh, actual specific engagement, uh, we use Cognizm quite a lot because it really does align with our sort of market strategy of where we're going with CapDesk. So we're aiming to sort of target a lot more of the EU rather than just the UK. So Cognizm really facilitates that with us being able to scrape a lot of the data, build out campaigns based on targeted personas and actually push them through to having very fruitful lists. So really helpful with that as well. And lastly, we use Crunchbase as well. So Crunchbase is super helpful with actually identifying a good business fit, especially for CapDesk and it, get an idea of how many employees, the headquarters, the amount of funding and what type of funding and maybe even who they're actually uh, backed by in terms of funding. So all of these sort of tools just align and really help to create a really smooth sales uh, sales cycle 